to the fitting cars, the idol worshippers or traditionalists. Likewise, the Christians in general. I say unto you, may the peace of the Lord be upon you all. I say unto the Muslims, all over the world that are here with me tonight and those that will join us later. I say unto you, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Tonight, I want to shed more light on an important issue that related to a man that called himself a former chief imam in one of the mosques in Ibadan, called Akpata Central Mosque. Later on, he became a Christian after so many years, according to the story. He said, he served, you, you, I will play the video and I will make sure I do justice to it. I know that uh, Christians will be here tonight. In fact, I even wanted any one of them to call during the uh, calling time because we need to shed, I mean, light. Although I'm not surprised anyway, it has been like that. This is not the first time. Can I remember one guy that called himself a imam in no show D. One uh, gym or something. I have to go down to Oshuri to confirm. If truly they knew anybody by that name. But eventually, it was all lies. But I don't know why the Christian believes in such things. I don't know why. How can somebody tell you something that is so crucial to your life, to your salvation, and you just believe outrightly? That yes, yes. is true. true. That a man, man that served as an imam for 26 years, yes. according to his storyline, story <laughs> went to Madrasa for 10 years, yes. now, now saw a light suddenly, suddenly and gave his life to Jesus. Mm -hmm. Why all these lies? Lights, lights, lights. When I was praying, I saw lights. I, saw light. I, I heard a sound. See, it baffles me a lot. So whenever I see such 
it baffles me more. That why should the same story go in the same line? The establishment of, of, of those things, those logic, is Apostle Paul, the self-acclaimed apostle. That was where the whole saga started. I saw Jesus when I was dreaming. I saw Jesus when I was walking. I saw Jesus. None of these disciples ever saw him after he has died. After he left this world. None. No disciple have ever met Jesus while dreaming. But let me just leave that for now anyway. But I, I know that it's a logic. It's a logic. It's a logic. Let me let me put in the video. Before I commence on it, I'll break it down one after the other. I'll break it down one after the other. Because he called himself Azan. An imam, a chief imam. In one of the Akwata Central Mosque. If it's not the one, Akwata Central Mosque is the one. Because Akwata is a village on its own in Ibadan. And they have an imam there. There are some past imam. The present ones was the present was interviewed by uh, my friend uh, uh, Alagi Soliu. Because I was also traveled to Ibadan yesterday. That was on Tuesday, yeah. But when I called him, he said he has done the work. I don't need to come to Ibadan. He has interviewed the imam. And the imam has told her the, everything about the mosque. Even the past imam was mentioned. So let's see the video. Please, no one should call now. No one should call now. No calling now, please. The video. Praise the Lord. Everyone. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Choose the praise, Master Jesus. Hallelujah. My name Just is take Brother notes. Hassan Yakubu. I'm from Mangogo in Kogi State. Mm -hmm. Okay. And I thank God for making me a choosing. Thank you, Father. Thank you, God of Chosen. I thank God for granting me genuine salvation. Thank you, Lord. That's the greatest miracle you should ask God to give you today. And by the special grace of God, I was born into a family of Mr. Yakubu Musa. I'm from Awuchi in Edo State, but we resided in Kogi State. And by the special grace of God, I was born 1968. And my testimony goes like this. And after my primary school, in primary three, my father and my mother decided for me not to go further in English school. The rather than going to an Arabic. I went to Amadou Bello Arabic school from 10 years. After that, I was graduated in 1992. In 1993, I was posted to Ibado as a imam in as, Akwata. As, as a chief imam mm. in Akwata, Ibado. Yes. Now, Amos. I was he said he had a genuine salvation. <laughs> you mean <laughs> Christian has a genuine salvation? It's not deception. A genuine salvation where? In Christendom. Christendom. Okay. He said he was born in 1968. We are going to calculate the year and see if he's really saying the truth. Now, he went to, from primary one to primary three. Now, somebody who has not even finished his primary school, can he speak a good English? 
as he was speaking now. No, let, let's just, he, he went to primary three. He didn't further. The only thing he did was to go to Arabic school. And in Arabic school, they don't speak English. You either speak the indigenous language, either Hausa or Yoruba or Igbo, then plus Arabic. Because I'm very sure the Amani Belo he went to, we don't even know, either in Karuna or in Aochi or in Kogi, we don't know. But he now said, in 1992, he graduated in that Arabic school, which means he has spent 10 years, according to the storyline. He now being posted. From where? Posted from Arabic school. To be a chief in Ibadan. No, all the Muslims, please. I'm not talking about the Christian now. In our own line, if it's not an organization like Anzaruddin, Nawaruddin, Amadi, and all that, that will post their missionary from one state to another, which how can an Arabic school posted an imam to Ibadan? From where? From Kogi states. He now been posted to Ibadan. We don't post imam here. So that's the first slice he has generated to us. You don't post an imam. If it was not an organization that posted you, and they can, you, are, you are not be posted to a town, you'll be posted to your branch. As I think, as I think, as big as they are, even, even uh, Nosfat cannot post an imam from Lagos here to be a chief imam in Ogu State. Like, no, never. You either be the imam of Nawaludin no, Central Mosque in that town. You can never be an imam of that town being posted. They don't post an imam. So that's a pure lies. They don't post an imam. Now, we now went ahead to Ibadan to interview the present chief imam because the video he made was this year. Even this month, if you look at the bib he was putting on, the program runs between 16 to 19 of February. And today is 20, 26, which means about uh, last week or two weeks ago. He made the video. And it has gone viral on social media. Now, look at the time. We now went to Ibadan. I sent Afar Soliu to meet the Imam. Because somebody called me to meet the Imam. But when Soli was there, he has sent Soli as well to take charge of the Imam. He now went to the Imam to interview the Imam. If truly some, so one of their Imams converted, Christian love to be deceived. I don't know the kind of thing they are doing. That's why I said to be an idol worshiper is better than, than to be a Christian. To be an idol worshiper is better than to be a Christian. They love to be deceived. They love lies. And that's why they are no, I, I don't know. They cannot be in charge of themselves. They cannot think. Pastor is in for them. They can reason for them. Any minor thing, hello, Pastor. What can I do? Hello, Pastor. Hello, Pastor. Pastor is a mini God. They don't even know God. They don't even know God. They believe that sin is believing. We now, I found, so we now went to the Imam and interviewed him in Yoruba language. I went to be interpreting what he said one after the other. Let me have a video of that very Imam, the present Akwata Central Mosque in Ibadan, the current Imam of that mosque. Let's see what the Imam said as per the Osaga. Baba, and you need to be mum at Pata Central Mosque. I go be a Pata. Baba, and you don't matter. I'm good away and a con tissue, mum be cut up at the Christian. Say, Elephu, I do a mum meta to TJK to Jay. 
Now, Baba. Now, the Avas only was interviewing the, the Imam. He now said, Are you the rich Imam of this Aquata Mosque? He was like, I will show you the, the, the billboard of that mosque. But the Baba now said, Yes. He now said, Can you just tell us the past Imams that have been in this mosque? Or is there anyone among them that has been converted? Here the response of the Imam. Lord, do you? 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 Do that's ever been in that mosque that have now late. He mentioned Echo, he mentioned Anzat and other one. He now said, Now, among all these Imam, was there anyone that got converted? He said, No, they died as a Muslim. That's the current Imam of that Akwata that the guy quoted. That he was one of the Imam. That's why, that's the reason, the reason why the other one said he was Imam in Oshodi before I went there myself. Why do you love to be deceived? And people are watching the video. They even share the video. Lies upon lies. Why? Why your thing is like this? And internationalists will never do that. Open worship will never do that. Oh yeah, will never do that. Why the Christian? Why? What's your problem? You deceive others and you are being deceived as well. You love deception. You know, said, let's continue. No. Now, the man now said, I've also now interviewed him and said, Is it possible to be posting a chief imam of a town from one place to another? He now said, Somebody was posted from Kogi to Ibadan here. The man now said, No, in the culture of Islam, you don't post a chief imam. From one town to another, it's not possible. You can only post a missioner from one society to another. You don't post a chief imam. So it cannot be posted to Ibadan. It's not possible. Lies. Now, let me now show you the, 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 the mosque billboard to confirm the name. And you see the imam. Again, as well. So, Akwata Central Mosque, Ibadan, on Lawai, that's the Christian Conquadu, on Tisha, Imam, Nemaslasi, Koto di Pon, the Christian. At Wawai, the artist Fior, or Waba, Bawa, Imam, Tiwa, Tiwa, Wa, Lori, or Ye, bye, 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 at Fior, Wa, Lenu. Once they can be my mother to get come to buy cook. But banana, I want to know what drew you. But banana, what drew the quality more? I want to chief imam, central mosque, a patai badan. If it's any compari, okay, on Tisha, mam, go to the Christian. Babati gyro, or okay, sinto jobe. But basta, they can't want to be mother to teach, go to the way, and what they imam. So any Christian, they ban waste to win any lemon. Tapi keti emu, kemu wasi badambi. Ko wata ke moto je joye emba towa lori man. Ko tube lo, alon wa pelo wa, alon oni si wa lo na. Aba, eshe adu pelo wa in. Now he said, no one has ever been posted. I've said the alarm. That's the billboard. The man said no, none. Was supposed to, and none became Christian among them. I first went and said, I advise the Christian, don't waste your money in sponsoring that liar. He needed money, that's why he was lying. He went to consume himself. You, you know, let's hear his testimonies. But before we go, even go to that, I said, I'm not surprised. I've quoted this verse time with, time with that number. <laughs> it's related to Apostle Paul. Self-acclaimed apostle. 
That's the logic he uses in converting the Jews and the Gentiles to be Christian when he was alive. Pure lies. Look at what he said. In the book of Romans chapter 3. Romans chapter 3. Don't be surprised. That's the culture. And that's the logic. From verse 5 to 8. Look at what he said. He said, But what if I are doing wrong? If I do what is wrong, the guy is doing what is wrong. Serve to show up more clearly God's doing right. If I do what is wrong, and people now felt that, ah, this is the truth in the sight of God. He now said, can we say that God does wrong when he punishes us? Can we blame God? Because God will punish this guy and other. If God now come to him now with his punishment, whom will he blame? Look at what God, Paul is saying. He now said, mm -hmm. by no means, if God is not just, how can he judge the world? You can see, if God is not judge, is not just, how can he judge the world? God is a just God. So all this logic means nothing to him. He will be punished. Verse 7, he now said, but what if, because he was being accused, he now said, well, but what if, my own truth, what Azan Yakubu said was untruth. It is untruth anyway. He was never an imam in that mosque. He has never been posted to anywhere. Confirm. You can go there yourself. Go to Akpata Central Mosque. Don't be a dummy. Don't be a zombie. How much is you, you live in Ibadan? Go and confirm yourself. Mosque is where to enter. You can go there and ask for the imam. That sir, I want to see you. I want to confirm some things. Is it true or false? Go and meet them. Or you meet any of the any of the members. If I'm not of the of the mom, go and meet any of the members. Go there around 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 two when they are praying Zul. Or you go there around on the Friday when they are praying Jumat. Go and interview any member that ever pray in that mosque. Ask them, is there any imam here named by Azan Yakubu? Show him the video. That do you know this man? You have to confirm. That is why Islam is the best. We don't follow then say. We confirm. Look at when this when it was it was announced that one of us right you became a Christian. We went there to confirm. To do what to confirm. And we knew what went wrong with him. And we tried to persuade and tell him the truth. But poverty has overshadowed him. Poverty overshadowed him. So and that's why we left him. We done our best. Go and confirm Azan Yakubu in that mosque. If truly you are looking for the truth. If you don't believe in lies, go and confirm. He has mentioned a mosque. Akpata mosque. Go to Oshodi to confirm that uh, Jimon as well. They all lies. They depend on this quotation. And they work with it. They depend on this quotation and they work with it. Look at what the quotation said. Verse 7. But what if my untruth, if I lied, serves God's glory by making his truth stand out more clearly? If I lied, as he was lying now, because there are so many nomi there are so many nominal Muslims that will follow suit. That wow, this guy saw Jesus in the mosque. Wow, I have to be a Christian. He has he has gained them. Because he lied. And people believe in his lies. They cannot go there and confirm. So he has he has he has done his, ev his own evangelism now. And he believe you'll be rewarded. You are to be rewarded. You are going to be punished because every soul that follows suit, you are going to be in charge. 
you are going to be judged accordingly. And everyone that shared that video, you are going to serve the same punishment. Because you are aiding lies. That was the God aiding and abetting. 21 years imprisonment in the world. But in the heaven, life imprisonment. You are going to be in hell. If you ever share that video again, you, you better share this one to enlighten others that that guy is a liar. And I'm going to pin every each and every of, of his word and explain to you. Now, he said, But what of him, my own truth, serves God's glory by making his truth stand out? Why should I be condemned as a sinner? You are looking for crowd. I lied for others. They came to the church and became a member. Then what's, what's your problem? Why am I still being condemned? Is that not the word you were saying? Hmm. Allah Akbar. Why not say, look at that. You know, say, why not say, then, let us do evil so that good might come. Let us do evil. Let us lie to them. Let us deceive them that good might come. The good is that we are going to gain the Muslims into chosen family. <laughs> we'll gain the Muslim into Christian family. Is that not the dimension? Will Allah will attend to this? What's his own problem? Will only never attend to this? The traditionalists, will they attend to this? <laughs> they will not even bother. What's our business? Imam becoming man, that's his own problem. But we ever say an Allah will confirm Allah will come out open that time once Allah will. He will never do that. If because he knows his, the, the consequence. He knows the consequence. Because most of the pastors are part of them. They are Illuminati. Most of them are Illuminati. But they kept on deceiving you. He now said, let us do evil so that good might come. He now, he now, he now said, some people indeed have insulted me by accusing me of saying this very thing. They will be condemned as they should be. And I was returning back to them. La ilaha illallah. That's the logic. They are, they are only playing your intelligence. They know Nigerians are gullible. They know. Even the Christians in the whole world, they are gullible. You can see how they are shouting. Hallelujah. That's a great miracle. We go to miracle. Miracle. Miracle all over. The blood miracle. Power. You have been deceived. There's no power anywhere. Something lies with God alone. Man has no power. Only God has the power. Not man. Let's go with the video. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Choose a praise, Master Jesus. Hallelujah. My name is Brother Hassan Yakubu. I'm from Mangogo in Kogi State, Okene. And I thank God for making me a choosing. Thank you, Father. Thank you, God of Chosen. So, he did thank, thank God, God for of bringing him to Christianity. Salvation. He was thanking God to be a chosen member. So all that Christians are fake. Is that not the meaning? Let's continue. <laughs> Thank you, Lord. That's the greatest If I'm not a chosen, you are a fake. You should ask God to give you today. Uh, to be and a chosen member. special grace of God. Member. I was born into a family of Mr. Yakubu Musa. I'm from Awichi in Edo State, but we resided in Kogi State. And by the special grace of God, I was born 1968. And my testimony goes like this. And after my primary school, in primary three, my father and my mother decided for me not to go further in English school, the rather than going to an Arabic. <coughs> I went to Amadou Bello Arabic school from 10 years. Where? Where? After that, I was graduated in 1992. In 1993, 
I was posted to Ibado as a Imam in as, Akwata. As, as a chief imagine. Imam. Chief Imam. In Akwata. Just Ibado. Chief Imam like that. Sir Chamos. Lies. I was there for three good years before I was posted to Okela in Oshu State. Hmm. Okela. In Oshu State in 1999, I was posted to Ibilo. Ibilo. In Endo State. Can you imagine? Again to year 2001, the post in Yoruba I was line. moving to Kano. Can you imagine? Kaduna, from Yoruba to Kano. As a chief imam. As chief imam again. He came to a portrait and where the like God of Chusi want to have an encounter with me. In the month of November last year, on the 18th, this is a testimony. Hey! Hey! <laughs> Thank you, Does Lord. How gullible they are. I was sleeping in my room by 1 a.m. when I was seeing a light was mm -hmm. shining in the four corners of my room. That is the same story. And that light, during the light, That's I was seeing somebody with half coverage. That's the same story. Go on, go on, listen to what that, uh, the man in Oshodi said. He saw everything was saw, every, every one of them was seeing light. The the very definitely saw a light. Light in me all day long. Light. Why? I said earlier on, when Jesus was alive, why has he been the been using this logic for them? Because when he came, the Israelites rejected him outrightly. You can read from John chapter 1, verse 11. He came to his people and they rejected him. So he has no power. And the other city to bring them his disciple. Why was he being persecuted? Okay, let's leave that. Maybe when he was alive, he, is, he, he, he was powerless. According to John chapter 5, verse 30, by myself, I can do nothing. Okay, when he died, I went to heaven. He now has the power. So when he now came back, according to the biblical story, when he appeared unto them in the upper house, according to the book of Acts of Apostles, now, how many Jews accepted him? How many Jews has he been appearing to for them to get converted at least they have been appearing to many after Paul now. The girl of this appearance, 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 light, light, is from Paul. And the girl was lying. After the earlier on, Paul was a liar. He lied to his, li his last day on earth. He lied. Can I, can I give his testimony? If truly he lied, and the whole story, I saw light. I saw light. Depends on what Paul said. Can it be confirmed? Can we believe in them? Christian, wake up. This is the right time you should wake up. Jesus has not called him to any, any church. Roman Catholic is there. Redeem is there. Mother of Iron is there. And other big churches. Even a Lateran assembly, Winner's Chapel is there. Jesus did not show him the church to go to all those places. He now pointed the Gesha church to him. <laughs> no, from, from Kogi to Gesha to Chosen. You can imagine that logic. You can imagine that logic. God of Chosen. So he needed Chosen, not redeem, not deeper life. Is, is, is that? Will, will other churches believe in this testimony? When, when you are not a redeemed member, you are not a winner, winner, you are not a winner member, you are not a, a deeper life member, not even Christ Embassy, you are now a chosen member. Jesus told you go to chosen. Chosen that was, was exposed by a woman that designed the apron for them that this apron is only to make money. 
Go and change it on, 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 on YouTube. The man declared that that apron is nothing. The GO just made you to make money. There's no power in that apron, no power. Was there not one time that a, a trailer crushed one of the members with the apron? And died immediately at the express. You mean the apron cannot save him? They just kept on formulating lies. I had one, one testimony as well this afternoon. The guy said he was, he was kidnapped by the either Boko Haram or anybody. And he was shot at the head with Boko Haram. And he was for AK-47. His head now exposed. Bring it all to. But he didn't die. Can you imagine? <laughs> because they thought he, he was dead. They now took him to the hospital. The old man said, ah, he didn't die. He didn't die. <laughs> Why now? Why Christian love to be deceived? Why lies? Hmm? Okay, it's only a dream. Okay, so it's a dream. Now let's continue. I'll come back to that very poor conversion. Let's imagine. Having lie. the BS I was having before, and I was measuring my name three times. Asan, 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 go out and join my people. Hmm. I look at the light, I was seeing the man, no leg, but I was looking at him in half coverage. And he was measuring my name with a loud voice. I should go out and join his people. There is a job I was attached with the imam that I was doing in Kaduna, we call it Cham and Rubutu. I dip hand from the bucket and I throw them to that light and the water came back and the now, man said, leave those... He said, there was a joy he was doing. He was preparing charms. As an imam, will, will, will you allow or is it Islamically right to prepare charms that you have to put, you have to throw at the Spirit that disturbing you. No rukia. No reciting of the Holy Quran. You be a charm. This guy is a liar. How can an imam be a charm to cast out a spirit that believe in as an, in an evil spirit? You have to be a charm. As regards that, lies. Let's continue. Go out and join my people. Who are his people? The light is up here. Is that not? All, the, all, all, break, all, all other Christians are not God's people. It's only chosen that are God's people. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Well, I haven't been alive for being a Muslim. Let's continue. The third day, in the same hour, one o'clock, the light came again. And he called my name. Go out and join my people. Then I ask him, I don't know anything concerning your people and I'm not your people. I'm a Muslim and I'm proud to be a Muslim forever. And he said, go out and join my people. That whatsoever you do by my name, Jesus Christ. And I discovered, ah, this is uh, Isa alayhi salah because in the Quran we call it Isa alayhi salah. And okay, now, I am not your people. And the Holy Quran said, I can never be your people. Now, what was the correlation of the of the chapter he has recited with I can I I, I know Isa What's the correlation? When God was causing Abu Lahab with his wife. For causing the problem, Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam. So what's correlation? Okay, the uh, sorry, the uh, the uh, the group of the elephants that came to destroy, wanted to destroy Kaaba back then, before the advent of Muhammad. So what does that got to do with Isa? <laughs> Can you imagine that? It was because Allah sallallahu alaihi wasallam gave a father of Kaaba when God destroyed the, the, the set of the elephants that, that wanted to destroy Kaaba, 
Why is he reciting that? For them to know that he says animal? La ilaha illallah. Let's continue. And uh, instead of being your people, I'm rather to die. He said, go out and join my people. Hmm. And after that, the light disappear and the hmm. mask gone. Wow. When they break, I nail a tira in the four corners of my rooms so that I will not see the light again. You see in what he said? Time, he said he packed some tira. You know what the the word tira means book. Tira means book. This is a tira. But what they meant by the word tira was a charm. Charm. That will be tied with rope, black, white, and others. That's not a tira. That's a charm. So as an imam, he believes in tira. And he called himself an imam. Why is he lying now? This guy was never a Muslim. He was trained for this. He was trained for what he was saying by the chosen. Continue. Those tira and the name Fonda, my eyes opened and the light came. <laughs> and the master said, leave those things. Go out and join my people. That whatsoever you do by my name, I will do it. I said, no. Why can't you leave me alone? I have told you that I am not a, your people. I'm a Muslim. A servant of Almighty Allah. I cannot go out and join your people. I know nothing concerning your people at all. When they break, I went to the general imam in Kanduna. I discussed the whole issue with him. Now, he gave me. When did they break? He went to the general imam in Kaduna. Who is the general imam in Kaduna? That's another, another, another question. Who is the general imam in Kaduna? And somebody will say, I want to general imam in Lagos State. Who is general imam in Lagos State? General imam. You mean we have, you have, a, we have a GO in, in the Kaduna? General. <laughs> Why now? This guy is a liar. There's nothing called general imam in Islam. We have chief imam. We have grand chief imam. There's no general imam. No general imam. You want to say general of Asia, of a church in Karina? No general imam. Lies. Let's continue. A tira. And he said, she put now it under tira. the pillow. Can you imagine? That when I put it, I will not see the light. Wow. In a faithful the general hour. imam, the general imam did not give him rukia as an imam that was being posted from Le, from Ibadan to Kela to Ibibio. He has never known the Quran that he read in in an Arabic school for ten years. He has to go and meet another imam. Is it not a general imam? An imam that was posted from Ibadan. To, to Okela, to Ibibio, to Kodokano, then to Kaduna. And a mom that was there in Kaduna, he has never traveled to anywhere. He has no experience in Lagos, no experience in Ibadan, no experience in Ibibio. You that travel far now have to go and meet another, a local imam. He's an international imam now. A local imam. Now get another tira. The tira he was he made by himself. Does not work for him. The imam does not give him another surah to be recited. He has forgotten all he knows due to the spirit that was after him. Day in the house. Lies. Uh -huh. I came back, oh, I put it on my line that when I returned from the mud, the light came. I discovered I wanted to take the tira so that I would take it to have the light. I couldn't see the tira under the pillow. <laughs> hey! Can you imagine? Ultimate in power. Yeah, Golibu. <laughs> imagine. They were happy. Oh. Hallelujah. It yeah. was when the light gone. And I saw the tira on top of my pillow. I said, ah, I've been looking for you. When the man came, then I went to the man. I discussed with him. He asked me to call my father. I called my father on the phone. I discussed the whole issue with him. And my daddy said, I should come down to Nkongi State. That is why I took my trafan 
Ba on the 27th of November, Ba to Okene. That was last year. When I get it to Okene, I was hand over. Hand over a must to me at Uburoke in Just, Gima. <laughs> Just like that. He came from Kano. When he got to Kogi, a, an empty mosque that has no imam. <laughs> is that, is, is, no, no, can you reason? This is not a church. This is not a Christianity. This is Islam. Our own settings is quite different from yours. You are business mongo. We are not business mongo. We are worshippers of God. We depend on God always. Allah. But you are business mongo. You can transfer pastors from one local to, to international. We don't transfer imam. So a, 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 an empty mosque that has no imam immediately handed over to him that if your problem is mosque, he has a mosque. He's an imam in Kano. Before he went to Kaduna, to be the general imam. And so he now, <laughs> he now go, get back to Kogi now. His father now handed an empty mosque that has no imam to him to be an, an achievement again. You can know. Just look at what he was saying. Use your number six to reason. Mm. Let's continue. This state. Then I was there. My father said I should sleep in his house. That you want to see that evil spirit <laughs> who is tormenting me in Kaduna. <laughs> I sleep in my father's house. On the four times the light came. Hmm. And the man said, It is now you will go out. I join my people. If you refuse, I will blind your eyes. And after taking your eyes, after blinding the eyes, you will still do the job. Hmm. Hmm. No, just, hmm. just check those stories and resolve them in your Medulla and Black Ganta. The, the Spirit said, I will blind your eyes if you refuse. You know what happened to Paul? Let me even read that Paul on to you. So I confirm all his lies. That he related all the story he was saying to that of Paul. Just relate it to by yourself. Let's look the book of Acts. Chapter 9, from verse 3 to 8, or 9. Look at the statement. As Paul was coming near the city of Damascus, suddenly a light from the sky flashed on him. No any other man in the Bible, in the old Bible, experienced such what Paul encountered. You can look as soon as I can't add it. Peter as never, uh, James as never, even the disciple of Jesus himself, the twelve, never encountered such when Jesus left. But it was Paul alone that Jesus appears to. Paul has never met Jesus in his life. Paul no know Jesus at all. He didn't know who Jesus is. He has never had a word from his mouth when he was alive. Because when Jesus was alive, Paul lived in Rome as a lawyer. Luke was his own doctor. Both of them came to Jerusalem after Jesus had left. After he has died, they came back to Jerusalem. Both of them. And all uh, the, the titles, the uh, uh, Thessalonians and others, they came together. They are from the Rome. And in Rome, <coughs> Up to now, they worship idol. They never, they, never, they never left their culture. They worship idol. Now, he now said, as Paul was coming out to Damascus, suddenly a light from the sky flashed around him. The light is lies. Light. Light flash. I saw light. It's all originator, originated from Paul's testimony. He now said, he fell to the ground and had a voice saying, Saul, so, Saul, so. he, he, he also had a voice. So go and join my people. Go and join my people. Go and join my people. 
His people are the chosen. Chosen church. Geo. Pastor Amwaka. Uh, that's the chosen. That's the God's people. All other churches are fake. They are evil people. They are for the devil. The only church of God is chosen by this man. And now, you are then redeemed. You, are, you go to your own church. Go to chosen. That's where God is. Now, you now say, so, so. Why do you persecute me? Who are you, Lord? Paul asked. I am Jesus, whom you persecuted. The voice said to me, but get up. Go into the city. You'll be told what to do. Verse 7. The man who were traveling with Saul has stopped. Which means he was not alone. He was not alone. But this guy was alone. But in that mosque in Akmata, he was not alone. Nobody can testify to what happened. That's another problem. Not saying a word, but they had a voice. But they could not see anyone. They had everybody had the voice that was calling Saul, Saul, don't kill them. Oh. <laughs> now, verse 8. Saul got up from the ground and is and opened his eyes, but could not see a thing. He was blind. You can see, if you don't do my job, I will blind you. <laughs> the same story. It was coined from this lie. They all coined. This is their mentor. Paul is their mentor, Paul. And although, normally, he is the originator of Christianity now. Don't you know? Paul founded Christianity, not Jesus. When Jesus was alive, there's nothing like Christian. Nothing like Christian. Nothing like even Christ. Jesus never had Christ in his life. No one ever called Jesus Christ in his life. Jesus is a Messiah, not Christ. There's nothing called Christ when he was alive. And from Christ came Christian. From Christian came Christianity. They are all taboo before Jesus. Now, he got blind. As this guy also got blind. <laughs> Mind you, in verse 7, they add the voice, but they see no man. Let me give you another testimony. Out 22 from verse 6 to 9. Same story. As I, I, was, I was traveling and come near Damascus about a midday, so a bright light from the sky flashed suddenly around me. I fell to the ground and heard a voice saying to me, Saul, 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 why do you persecute me? Who are you, Lord? I asked. I'm Jesus of Nazareth. Who are you persecuted? He said to me, The men who are with me saw the light, indeed, but do not hear the voice of him who was speaking to me. Do they hear the voice or not? In 3 verse 7, they heard the voice. In, in 22 verse 9, they did not hear the voice. But what happened later? And I asked, what shall I have me Lord to do? The Lord said to me, get up. I'm going to Damascus and you will be told everything that God has determined for you to do. I was blind because of the bright light. <laughs> Can you imagine that? Do they have the voice or not? That This is the origin of all the cooked stories. This is the origin of all the cooked stories by this guy called Azan Yakub. He formulated the whole thing and gave it to the chosen. Although it's part of them anyway. <laughs> Let's continue. Praise the Lord. I went to my mother in the midnight. I wake my mother. We are 36, 39 children of my father. He has six wife. Now, 39 children. 39 children. His father has six wives. In Islam, is it proper for a Muslim to have six, six wives? Capital, no. That means he lied against the father. 36 children from six wives. Definitely, a wife must 
have given birth to six children, is that not? But eventually, his mother alone gave birth to 16 children. 16. You hear from his testimony? 16 children. Still living. All the 16 are still living. Is that true? Let's continue. Of the 39 children of my father, I have okay, the only 39. son. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. My mother gave birth to 16 because uh, we are three in number that we bought. They say they two girls are me. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. And when I discussed the issue with my mother, and I told my mother, Can I wait with this my condition? And I'm be blind, making two. And I demand said, after he blind the eyes, I will still do the job. And if you say that, okay, I will blind your eyes, I leave you. I will prefer that because I will know where to knock my head on the ground and still leading my people. But he said, after I blind the eyes, you will still go. You can see my people. Where I said, no, to I will knock wait until my head. head. Knock my head. I was still a Muslim then. I know where to knock my head. Reason with that. To knock my head. And it was a Muslim then. <laughs> like, before I know where to go. Hey! Praise the Lord. Hallelujah! Then, my mom and my father started bringing an idea what to do. That this degrees and see finish will be too much. If people discover that Imam who went to an Arabic school and be Imam for 26 mm. years Akika. became a Christian. Mm. Lies. My mommy said that she took me to my father Junior brother place at Mangogo. That after getting there, he knew him that he sabi do charm very well. Mm. This is how the desire so to that's an to anyway. Mangogo. Mm. Mangogo. Of getting to Mangogo, we are eating together after the food. We put <coughs> telly, we watch. In the same time, one o'clock, the light came. I, I look, I opened my eyes. I was looking around. I couldn't see my brother. I don't know that he went out to humiliate. He came and he saw the light, but according to him, he said he did not hear the voice. Hmm. But he saw the light. Yes, sir. Hmm. After that. Do you, do you understand that logic? <laughs> but he said, but he saw the light. But he did not hear the voice. You can know. Correlate that with what Paul was saying here. They saw the light, but did not hear the voice of him who was speaking to me in Acts 20, verse 9. But in Acts 7, verse 7, verse 9, verse 7, they heard the voice, but they see no man. But in his own case, the, his brother, that was a juju man, an analyst, saw the light, that there was a light that shone. Who is that brother? Let him tell us. To go and confirm if truly what was saying is right. They are all liars. At least, if he cannot give his own address, he should have bold enough to give address of his brother in Magogo. That if I'm lying, go to Brazil and confirm if truly I'm lying. Has he given any address? Where, where is Magogo? At where? In which area? If not for as mentioned at Quarter Central Mosque, nobody will have traced anything about him. You will not even really, really know where he was, where he was coming from. Lies. Let's continue. We, he took the phone, I called my parent. I discussed the whole issue with my mother. And my mommy said, ah, the lies still pursue him to your place? And he said, yes. It was that midnight that I started sleeping. I began to see people putting on this cloth. Apron. Dancing. Apron. Hey. <laughs> hey. Hallelujah. Amen. When I wake up, 
because that my uncle was a shoe cobra. I normally stay work along with him. So I was in the shop when the, the, the house we are living, there's a co tenant there, an evil woman. I discovered the revelation with her. And I said, I normally see people with uh, road safety, uh, mopo like this. The woman started laughing. And she said, This is not uh, a road safety. Oh. This is a church called a choosing. I said, ah, Is there any church bearing such name? Where are they putting out uh, Bulepu? He said, This is not Bulepu. They call it April in that church. He was, she was a member. You mean as popular as chosen one all over Nigeria? He has never saw anyone when he was a mom then for 26 years putting on that apron. He has he's not been going out. When he walks along, he closed his eyes on the street. So he has never saw, he has never heard about chosen in his life. For 26 years. He has never known who Joseph was. He has never saw the apron alive until he had a dream about them. Can you call, can you can you think and reason along with yourself that this guy is a bunch of liar? He lies. All what he was saying was mere propaganda. He was being trained to do this. To tell the whole world that chosen choice is the best. Don't go to redeem again, go to chosen. That's the gospel. Liar. I know you don't believe in that if I if I, if I redeem member or other churches member. Continue. Of that church that she say the same village with the general of Asia in Imo State. I said, okay. Yeah. She said, I should come to their house. When I came around for her, she put the cable. And I saw Fatma in their midst. I started telling the woman, I said, yes. This man was preaching yesterday. He said, yes, this is General Vasya, Pastor Lazarus Moka. I said, yeah. He's the owner of the church. He said, yes. I said, okay, please, can you tend them? If they can help me to pray so that I will not see this light again. And that woman said, why they left the church is that the church is a dangerous church. It's been confirmed. So now. they are now worshiping Catholic church. He went and turned the Reverend Father. And when the Father came, I told the Father that the religion was coming out is greater than where you are. Because majority of you people am working with you people. So I don't think if I still decide to go with you, that means my eyes will still black because I am stronger than you people. Then I told him like that. It is from there. Another woman came. I shared the vision with her. And the woman went to that evil woman, was querying with her. Why can't you show this man when Chuzi is in this community? If you are not a member of Chuzi, it doesn't mean that you will not tell him to where to go. Brother, don't worry. He will search where the church is in Mangongo. She later, afterwards, three days, she came back, saying that he saw one woman putting on April. That he had told the woman concerning me, that the woman said, she's going to brought an Okada who will come and carry me to the church. Chosen and people. Uh, it came to pass <laughs> on December 25. Uh, uh, lie, lie, lie. I was in the front of my house. So, I all, all said, other please. churches have... have a failure. All that you have scam. Is, is that not the meaning? Roman Catholic, it's a scam. Regime, it's a scam. Sele, scam. Uh, deeper life, scam. Christ Embassy, scam. Winners Chapel, scam. It's only chosen. It's God's people. No, they, they understood all what is going among them. They knew that I only needed more members, more membership. To me, that church, he needed more people. That's why they brought out this guy to defend Chosen as a church, the best church in the whole world. <laughs> Let's continue. Uh, I'm looking for a shoemaker. I say yes. Which one are you looking for? He said the one that called Imam. I say I'm the one. He said yes. They say I should carry you come. 
to a church called Chuzi. I said, okay, let's go. I went with him. Hmm. Am I getting to the church? Mean, I saw people sitting there with this. Mean, just for that short period that he has stayed with that brother in Mangogo, he has learned how to make shoes. How many days has he lived with, with the guy? Four or five days. So he has learned how to make cobblers. So when the woman came, he was asking for the cobbler man. Was he the one who was asking for, or the brother himself? No, just make sure you think and you, you make the correlation. The two stories. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So, uh, my pillar say this is the particular place I was seeing in the dream. And that woman was lying for me that is in Lagos. I didn't know that this is where the headquarters is. I thought it's from Mangogo. So, and I share with the pastor, I asked the pastors to give me this April. That is what December retreat on 25. And the mm. pastor pulled it and gave it to me. Mm. My coming back from the church, they dropped a message. That woman have went, that evil woman have went to tell my mother that I went to the church. My mother dropped a message that I should meet her in the house in Okene. When I was going, I wear my cigarette, I wear this April inside before I wear shirt on top. <laughs> my getting there is a cool story. My mother cool said story. we should go to one Ampalis, very close to Bini. Can Ekoma. you imagine? We went there together. Our mother I drive my mother. That was a Muslim. Now took him to an Albert list. No, no I say no. what's the correlation with, with all these things? How can a mother took an imam of 26 years to an abalis? She didn't took her to, to took him to another imam. She didn't took him to a missionary in Islam. He now took him to an abalist. Can you imagine? All lies. Cooked stories. Just as you read the of everybody, ah, this is the, the man of God truly. Lies. It's a planned work by the chosen. It's a planned work. Clear planned work. Continue. To elevate chosen. Because I can drive. We went to that place and the man put something from my head. He removed it. He said, no, I should go out. It, I don't know what to discuss with my mother. They call me back. He now poured the charm and the water on my body. What surprised me most, the tira and the rubutu, he stained the shirt when I wear and stayed the inner singlet. But to today, not to stay the April. Power! <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine? Ultimate oh, power! Imagine. They are tough with their unbeliever. Amen. What is power in common uniform? Common then uniform. when we came back, and when we coming back, I was telling my mother, I said, I wear two cigarettes. But that would not touch the white. It didn't touch the middle. Hmm. And when we, when we dropped, I took a taxi down to Mangogo. I dropped for the woman, please. I said, Madam, this is what I encountered. He said, I have told you that that church is a dangerous church. That you should not go there. Look at it now. The robot don't stay your shirt. I stayed the inner singlet and did not stain the apron. I said, Well, I am descended to join those dangerous people. Power! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Human being, Inshallah, you'll be delivered. Every chosen member will be delivered tonight. Every chosen member. Even every Christian. Praise the Lord! Oh, Look at Let's the cool story. The conclusion of the matter. Let me conclude. Look at the cool story. This is a picture of my ordination as a chief imam. We can see it on the screen. It's a scam. That's you on the screen there. Look at the picture. It's a scam. We can see this picture on the screen. It was then, not told. 
And I told the woman that I am descendant to John the dangerous people. Hmm. Yeah, the picture. And then from there, the Can news that? was now spearing out that the chief imam getting converted to Christian. The follow day on 26. They just design him. People came on December and make it to be like that. They pack on the load. It was a design. In the house, pack everything and throw me out. I started trekking to the church to go and see the pastor. Then I discussed the whole issue with him. Then I told him that I am fed up. He said, no, this is just the beginning. And I thank God he prayed along with me. And favor started coming hey! from the choosing the brethren in Magongo. You see now. Even the, guy the God is of damn choosing used the lady. So he needed money. She first of all decided that she's not renting the house again. Then I said, Mommy, if it is Jesus that told me to go and join his people, you are a deacon in the church. Why can't you look unto that man? I gave the house red. He said, Now you have money to pay. I said, No. I have a phone. I removed my C card. I give it to her. And she gave me the house to rent to today. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. After my parent son that I am still living in that place on 29th of December. That native doctor who poured me something when the tea does not affect the April. I was in the church of 29. My two sisters come in that the native doctor died. <laughs> the native daughter died. Yeah, can you hey, where is at this oh, point? Me. Give my mother. Where is the native a... doctor's address? In Mangogo. Because I you know, I'm going to confirm every bit of the story. It's a pity I don't have the address. I will have traveled to Auchi to confirm. Travel to uh, Kogi State to confirm all this. But I know it's mere lies. He gave no address. To go, he went to Imo State, no address to go. He was saying the truth. Let him tell us the address. We are not mindful of him. Just to confirm from those he has mentioned that are you surely the Baba of Azan Yakubu? How many children do you have? We interviewed him and played it here for the world to see. This guy is saying the truth, though. But it's a mere lies. He's even bold enough to show his face. For, or are the chosen? They needed him there. The other Jimo, we don't even know him. We don't know his face. People will be saying eh, he can be killed. Nobody will kill him. Has this guy ever been killed? Has he been killed? Apart from he was, he's, he's lying. Who will kill him for what? You see, Islam is a peaceful religion. We are the most peaceful on earth. The most peaceful. We have been marginalized all over the world. But we don't care. Look at what happened to us in China. Look at the result they are getting. Although it's, 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 it's a... It's, 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 I, I don't know, I don't know. It's a pity. Because that coronavirus is dangerous. And it's affecting everybody. And I pray Allah to forgive them. And took the virus away. Although, it has to do with the Western world anyway. I don't know. But it has nothing to do with Islam. Nothing to do with Islam. Nothing. Look at how we are being marginalized. In our own state. In Syria. In Iraq. In Afghanistan. Go and Google it. There is no war. There is no place today that there is war. In no, if not for Muslim towns, Muslim countries. All the allegation leveled against Iraq that was having a, a nuclear a nuclear weapon was declared by a UN that Iran uh, Iraq has no nuclear weapon. But what was the result? America went to the town to destroy it and kill Saddam Hussein. 
Just like that. Nobody could say anything. Nobody could say anything. Hillary Clinton said, we created Al-Qaeda. We created ISIS and all that. All that was being created by them. They kept on saying they are all Muslims. They are war all those people are warriors. Boko Haram, they are warriors. They are not Muslims. They are not Muslims, are not Muslims at all. Their job is to fight war. They are being rented. They are being paid. By who? Unknown man. But I know the judgment will fall upon every each and every one that has a mind of victimizing the Muslims. The judgment of God will soon arrive on you. Will soon pawn on you. I'm very sure. We have been, been, been victimized all over the world. Can the Muslim now come out today <laughs> that I was once a Christian? Uh, this is what happened to me. Cooking some lies. I will tell him blindly, guy, you are a liar. Don't tell me that. Let's know your place. Let's know your house. Let's know your, your relatives. So I will confirm your stories. But today, people believe in lies. Day in, day out. Look at this. Wanted to elevate chosen over redeem, over Catholic, over all the churches in the world. So the lost people, Jesus people are the, the, the chosen alone. Chosen. Lazarus, Amaka. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But it's a pity that people have been deceived. That's what the Bible said. Oh, chapter 6, verse 4. My people perish for the lack of knowledge. They perish for the lack of knowledge. They kept on. People perish for the lack of knowledge. Are they not perishing? How can a normal person believe in this guy? A normal person believes in what he was saying. If you are normal, I can believe in this. Hosea chapter 4 verse 6. He said, my people perish. Hosea 4 verse 6. For the lack of knowledge. In Good News Bible, he said, my people are doomed because they do not they do not acknowledge me. They don't have knowledge. They don't know how God operates. They don't even know him. Because they are pagan. They are Gentiles. They are Kufars. They are pagan. For them to believe in all what he was saying. To believe in this guy. Calling himself Yaqub Azan. Where does he reside? How can we know him? To confirm all the stories. To meet the general imam in Kaduna. Where is address? Which mosque? Being addressed as general imam mosque in Kaduna. Where is general imam mosque? I called someone. Is there any general imam? General imam? What are you saying, Labaka? Me, I don't know. That's what I heard from this guy. General imam in Kaduna. General imam. <laughs> Let's finish his own story, Joe, and let's this space for, for the caller session. On the Buddhist crusade or the tree, I was planning to go with my pastor. They called me that my mother had fall for toilet. I said, hey, what happened? Pastor, let me go there. My getting there, it was in my present. The tea finish. Mm. My mother gave up. His mother died. Your mother also died. And that particular too, night died. that so, my mommy gave up. Who are you to confirm the whole story now? Everybody has died. I saw one old man just came and wake me. I said, ah. I was so shocked. I said, sir, I might know you. He said, no. Don't worry, brother. You are welcome. The man was praying along with me, telling me that somebody he needs to die for your glory to shine. Hmm. Hey! Hmm. Hey! 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 
So man needs somebody needs to die. Somebody needs to die. Can you imagine for my glory to, to shine? shine. Hey, can you, you imagine? Say, yeah, say, I lost Jesus. my mother. Somebody has to die for you to be uplifted. Is that a good thing to reason at? Is that how your God so wicked to should have killed someone for you? Is that no wickedness? And this guy was saying, hey, hey. He was even happy. Although I'm not surprised anyway. You know, their, their regular prayer was, uh, all my enemy bend down and die. All my enemy bend down and die. Die, 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 die. Always enemy with the Christians. They never free for one day from enemy. If a Christian should pray for prayers, three will be for enemy. One for him or half. Three and a half for enemy. The half is for him. How can somebody be praying? All my enemy bend down and die. Ah, are you so wicked? Can you forgive your enemy? See, your Jesus said, forgive your enemy. But you don't forgive your enemy. Oh. Say, all my enemy bend down and die, 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 die. So somebody has to die for your glory to shine. And you're happy. You're not even feel sober. Even the ordinary pastor there will say, hey, hey. Can you imagine? Cooked stories. I know they are going but anyway. Let's continue. Uh, yesterday, he said, don't worry. In First Peter chapter 4, verse 30 to 16, he gave me those, those quotations. First Regarding Peter, Galatia chapter 6, chapter 4, verse, verse 16 to 18. Let me read that First Peter chapter 4. First Peter chapter 4. Can you imagine? He didn't give, the Spirit didn't give him what Jesus said. He didn't give him Matthew to read, Mark to read, John to read, Luke to read. He was, he was given at, I mean, 1 Peter chapter 4. Can you imagine? That should be the evil spirit then. It should be evil spirit. <laughs> Look at what 1 Peter chapter 4 says from verse 16. It says, mm, However, if you suffer because you are a Christian, don't be ashamed of it, but thank God that you, you hear Christ's name. Verse 17, the time has come for judgment to begin, and God's own people are first to be judged. If it starts with us, how will it end with those who do not believe in God's news from God? As the scripture says, it is difficult for you people, for good people to be saved. What then will become of godless sinners? That's the quotation the Holy gave him. He gave him the story that was written after Jesus. He didn't give him the story when he was alive by himself. You can confirm it by yourself. Continue. Continue. And when they break, yeah, he has quoted I started the calling, send message to our pastor to come. Then I told him, I said, I saw one old man. And the man is telling me to continue. To continue. There are someone needs to die for my glory to shine. <laughs> if people begin to die, they will say that it's because of this dangerous church. I said, okay. I went to, the, to my mother's place for the burial. It was from there, all my sister was beating me. That a woman told mm -hmm. them in Mangogo that me. I went to the, John the Dangerous Church. Do you want to come and kill us? Eh, 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 oh, if you check the age, 1968 up to now, how many years that? 50 plus. His sister was beating 50 plus boy. <laughs> Let's continue. Please go! Go and meet the dangerous people <laughs> that you have John. I said, no, this is not how it be. The church is not killing anybody. We don't have, we are not using charm like that as we are using charm. And I put all my ring, all the garment, the ring that I used to talk before I entered tree. And the garment I used to go to the very grand. I didn't take them along to the church. Hmm. Ah, you people now saying that this church is a dangerous church. Even the church, if I carry those garments, they pray for it, the, the power will go nowhere. <laughs> and they said, no, 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 no. I should go. I want to drove in out. I came back to my Google. 
I begin to wonder, I say, am I starting afresh in life? I said, okay, the pastor started coming. <coughs> Remember, miracles started happening different, different way in the Lord choosing in Mangogo. I started living. Then, in the midnight, the man started coming, preaching to me. That's, don't worry, somebody who is going to be an interest for your calling is going to die for your glory to shine. I, I thought it was end in my mother's side. On the 30 of January, my father was traveled. This is an Okotis man, a bony man, traveled to Agbo when their brothers in the association died. On his way coming back, he had an accident with Dagute and died. Hmm. His father hmm. also died. Hmm. Yes, the Lord. So that's the Hallelujah. man who died. That's the man to die for his glory to On shine. On my way, travel to the particular Cooked place. Cooked life. Cooked life. I was inside the vehicle. I sleep. I remember the man told me that somebody he needs to die for your glory to shine. Hey. And from there, we put my father, we brought him back to the village. And I wanted to do the sadaka. You know, he's a Muslim. They gave Sadaga. me 60,000 naira to Can pay and look up and look down. Wait, I said, I paid. A, a, a whole 26-year imam. Father died. You need to do Sadaka. <laughs> what Sadaka and Fidao? He didn't know the difference between Sadaka and Fidao. An imam that went for, that went to 10 years of Arabic school. Does not mean of Sadaka and Fidao, la ilaha illallah. They want to sad that sadaka for the for the father, not Fidao. <laughs> Let's continue. 30,000, the church, we are very few. We pay 30,000 in my mother's burial. And you people are still giving me 60,000. Where do you want me to get this there back? Come my pastor, let me say to my pastor. My pastor said, don't talk, don't talk. Just agree, read the list. And I come. I was going to Kenya, I put on the apron. Along the road, I just saw the brother just drive. He said, hello, are you going? I said, yes. He said, are you a choosy? I said, by his grace. He said, I should enter. I entered inside. I was sharing my testimony with him. He took my picture. Imam picture, Allah. He said, oh, he's a member in the Lord choosy in Abuja. And said, please, don't worry. When you get to Abuja, he will call me. I said, I don't have my phone. I have sold it. I give him my pastor number. And I told my pastor when I came. And my pastor said, the man called him. We started getting connection with the man. And he took my, uh, my picture and I told the, the pastor. Later on, after the death of my father, I called the pastor in Abuja. I told him everything. And he sent me 30,000 naira for wow. the payment of the system. Wow. Clap on the God of the choosing. Thank you, Father. This is what the God of choosing Yo, started naira. doing before my state pastor and autonomous pastor in Kogi State, in Lokoja, take over the and is. pay the money. My open eyes, how I gave them their 60,000. My two cool sisters anyway. started up with that. How did you get this money? Hey. I said, the God of choosing is the God that asks her. Prayer! <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Thank you, Father. Thank you, God of choosing. Brother, what surprised me most is this. I still continue asking myself, from the 10 years I have wasted in Arabic school and 26 years in Imam, making 36 years. Can I spend such years as a pastor in ministry? Hmm. I'm starting asking myself, but I thank God today for the God of choosing who are having their canton with me. And this is my testimony. Hmm. Now, and I wish my geo more anointing and more grace and more power to run this race and more power to deliver every soul and brought us to the kingdom of God. And I wish in heaven at last and all the brethren and the Lord choosing in worldwide in Nigeria. Thank you. I cover my Hold on a moment. Hold on a moment. You need to clarify something for me. Now, that's the end anyway. That revision has to do with uh, how he saw Mwaka. Now, we've all listened to the cooked stories. And I have pointed out 
some points that need to be deliberated on. One, it was never an imam in Akwata confirmed. Two, in Islam, chief imams are not to be posted <coughs> to anywhere. You don't post imam from Kogi to Akwata. Who is he? Does he reside in Ibadan, Akwata? There will be order to be posted from Kogi to Akwata Central Mosque. Of which organization? Because Akwata Central Mosque is not for organization. It's for the community. <laughs> Who posted him to Akwata? That's two. Imam was not posted in Islam. You don't post chief imam. You posted missionaries from one organization to another, not to a community. <laughs> if you don't have any brand there, you don't post anybody. Three. He was he met with general imam in Kaduna. In Islam, there's no general imam. There's no geo. <laughs> there's no geo in Islam. Four. We don't know the addresses of where he has lived in Mangogo. <laughs> he has never learned Shukobla. He was addressed as Shukobla. For how many days has he lived without Abalao? With his Shukobla job. Again, where is the Madras, I mean the Arabic school he went to in Amadu Belo? Is that the university in Kaduna? Or am I below in Kano? Or am I below in Weir? We need to get all these things to confirm the cooked stories. Now, let me, let me, um, what else? I don't know. Yeah. I think I'm okay. I think I'm okay. Just to ensure that that guy lied. His name was never Azan Yakubu. I'm very sure of that. His name was never Azan Yakubu. I'm very sure. He cooked the story. That picture that you saw with him, it was, uh, what's it called? Photoshop. It's a Photoshop. They consumed him and put everything as it is. You can see that picture. He has mustache here. Yeah. As a chief mom, you have a mustache. You don't have beard. A chief mom, you either shave the mustache and shave the beard. You cannot put on mustache and shave your beard. As a chief mom, it's not possible. I wish you go and check all the imams' picture that you have, you have been seeing. Mustache. Eh? Lies. Lies. So, so, let me allow you to call him and discuss this issue once and for all. That guy was never a Muslim, confirmed. Was never an imam, confirmed. He has not been possessed anywhere, confirmed. We don't know where he lives in Mangogo. We don't know his village in, uh, uh, in Auchi. We don't know his village in Okogi State. It was a cook lie. Headed by the chosen. It was a cook lie. Headed by the chosen. They wanted to elevate their church over all, all churches. Although they are all liars, though. Christianity is a taboo. It's never from Jesus. Jesus said, I was not sent to you. So how can Jesus appear to you? The man you are seeing is a devil through you. It's all a man. He's a devil. When Jesus was alive, he hasn't appeared to any of his disciples. They were 12. <laughs> Let me read their names. Paul was never part of them. Not even Luke or Mark. Matthew chapter 10. Let's hear the names of Jesus' disciples. From verse 1. Jesus called Matthew 10 from verse 1. Jesus called his 12 disciples together. And gave them authority to drive out evil spirits 
and to heal every disease and every sickness. Verse 2. These are the names. <coughs> Sorry. Come These are the names of 12 apostles. First, Simon. Just give me some minutes. Simon Peter and his brother Andrew. That's two. James, three. His brother John, four. They are son of Zebedee. Philip, five. Bartholomew, six. Thomas, seven. Matthew, eight. James, son of Ephos, seven. Nine, sorry. Thaddeus, the Simon Par Patriot, and Judas Iscariot. They are what? They are 12 in numbers. Have you ever had Paul? Had Mark? Had Luke? So you don't ever appear to every one of them. It appears to his enemy. There was persecuting in Cyprus. Cook stories. That's where the problem started. Hello? Salam alaikum. Wa alaikum. Who is calling from where? Uh, uh, I... Hello? Hello? Okay. Hello? Calling from Canada. Pardon? Salam alaikum. Wa alaikum. Where are you calling from? My name is Maru. I'm calling from Canada. Okay. Your name, please. Hello? Yeah. My name is Maru. Okay, from Canada. Now, see me like. You see, uh, Ustaz, yeah. all those, all, all I, I, I follow this, uh, your program from the beginning to the end. Okay. All what that I said is just a cook lie. Yeah. There is no any truth. There is no any iota of truth. Yeah. In what they all what they said. Of course. So I don't. I don't Hello. I don't. I don't know. Please don't. Uh, spending money in, 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 in or your time in, you know, no, for enlightenment. What you say. I know, for enlightenment, I know, I know it's a good life, but to enlighten the people a and our people as well, will not be seen. Yeah. a reasonable, ah, uh, a reasonable list. It's, I just say, it's I all, say it's all over the world. In fact, somebody, the guy that shared it to me is a Muslim. That see what's going it's on. It's all right. There are people that are vulnerable. Of course. Yeah. We need to enlighten them. Even our own people as well. Because they are, they are easily convinced. A, 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 an imam that said he, somebody who said he is an imam for 26 years, who does not know the difference between Sadaka and you, man, and, and, uh, and I mean, <laughs> <laughs> and he got his own imam for 26 years. How, how, I don't know, I don't know why people are just being horrible. No, that's Christianity for you. They are just all those, all those, they are all those, they are, all those, they are G old and all that, they are just repeat. Of course, they are amazing. That's why out of them. When, yeah. you online, when, you go, when you go online, when you go, when you see so many things, even within the Christendom, of you course, you see so many things. You see how they are accusing their pastors and all that. Yes, yeah. they, people no, still remain. They just started place. anyway. They just started. There is more to read. And more is yet that to come. Their pastor is their God. Yeah, of course, of course. Uh, he's, he's so, he's so, they he's don't so, know God. He's so, he's so unfortunate. They are pagan. So they don't know God. They don't know. They don't know God. They don't know. They don't know God. They don't know God. No problem, inshallah. It's so unfortunate, honestly. Even when, upon all what you have been doing to enlighten them to open their eyes, they still remain gullible. Look at uh, this, uh, this, 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 this guy. 
Kurede and uh, uh, Gesang. Gesang and Kuh. And now, they are making their hands meet. Please. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. You cannot organize a crusade. No, for the, for the past how many years that uh, Isang has been, uh, has been chasing and now, you up? Yeah. He's treated all the topics. But he still remain adamant. I don't know. I've done my I'm best. So organize the crusade by yourself to call, to call, to call. To call. No, then no call Christian one sign. Come and ask question. Then. No he Christian cannot. one sign. That's the problem. No Christian one sign. Because they knew he didn't know 14. anything. He's so unfortunate. Yeah, he didn't know anything. <laughs> You want to put them to shame. May God continue to, to, um, to, guide, amen, to, to, amen, to guide you, amen. sir. Amen. To protect you and your family. Amen, amen, amen. All right. All right. Hello? 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 Salam alaikum. Salam alaikum. Salam Who's calling from here? Who is calling from where? Hello? Yunus from New York City. Okay, 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 sir. Now. Hello? Yeah. Hello? Hello, I'm hearing you. So go and tell me if I can be able to get a lot of money. I to Kawadi kade magbe wa kawani ko mama wa lo si gbogbo bi to ti lo n ba iye iye lawo o ni awo 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 e na o tori pa a ni body to coordinate e ni ka wa ti gbe meji lo se won nu won to paro won wa to ba ti sa e se ma pe ru to se o ni body to le se ni is it allow one here? You know the lecture. Eh, but ya bo ba ba ma tin bo ba yi. Ori te ba te te ti a ba te te pe ni se. O me ma ma continue to se pe o ma wa to bi. O ma e ma wori o ma de kun jo kan ma wori. Owo ma ba kan jo kan nu won. Mo ti ri pe photo yen. Mo ti ri pe an kan bi o ju e si bi fo. Won ko su mu e ni. E na ko su mu. O ti e ta lo Okay, okay, as yeah, can you speak in English? Yeah, I want to speak with the um, Baba. It's yeah, what, what? Yeah, what's the name? Where are you calling from? I'm calling can from you please, Lagos. Pardon? Lagos. Yeah, can you please lower your Facebook account? Okay. <laughs> Can you hear me now? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. I want to speak with him. Yeah, mm -hmm. I'm online. I'm listening to you. The online? I'm hearing you. Hello? Yeah, I'm hearing you. Lower down your Facebook okay. account. Yeah. Yes. Hello? Hello, I'm hearing you. Lower your Facebook account. I'm marrying you. Speak up. Hello? Can you hear me? Yeah, yeah. I can hear you now. Whoever that wants to call to this program, I've been saying it. 
you have to lower your Facebook account, either your phone or your laptop. Just lower it to the minimum level. Because if you are listening to me and looking at the Facebook, you'll be thinking, I'm not with you. Because you need to, you need to delay. You used to delay at least for about 10 seconds or more. But you have to lower the volume. Don't look at the Facebook at all. Call and listen. But my action, without the action in that, in that Facebook, will not go on together. Because it, it will have a delay for sure. So you have to lower your account, then we we'll talk. <laughs> By tomorrow, inshallah, our weekly lecture will come up at um, Olushi Street, beside Sikra and Debarisa's house in Isolo. Thursday is 9 to 11. Friday, 9 to 11. Saturday, 10 till dawn. If you have any question, you have it to be there. You have it to be there on Friday. It's free to be there on Saturday. Any question shall be entertained. Hello. Hello, Salam Alaikum. Who is calling from where? Pardon? Pardon? Salam Alaikum. Where are you calling from? Brother Ahmed from the street. Okay, okay, okay. Now, firstly, I thank God, uh, I thank God Allah for sending your life to this uh, moment. Alhamdulillah. And for the knowledge he has bestowed on you. Alhamdulillah, alhamdulillah. Uh, if not because of Allah in you, that you use people like you and some other people like you, these people are ready to conceal thousands of Muslims by of the take uh, information. Yeah, that's, that's a mission, yeah. yeah. Even that, uh, the first imam that uh, first declare, take imam that first declare instead of uh, uh, some time ago, mm. that uh, he was speaking behind the screen, I mean, behind the screen, mm. he has confused so many people. Of course, Even of course. A, a, a friend of mine from other region sent that message, sent that, uh, that uh, audio to me. Yeah. And before you made a, a program on it, I rebook everything. But later on, you made a program on it. Yeah. So that this is, it, it, I mean, it, the, the, the program is sent to somebody that doesn't know anything about religion, maybe just to follow the, uh, the what the mom said and just to follow the congregation, they will quickly get sweet. Yeah. But thank God for this opportunity. And with this now, although I have never seen the uh, video before, but okay. with what I saw, to name. I mean, uh, this man, but you uh, really uh, do, 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 do seem a great job. Yeah, I mean, my yeah, prayer yeah. for him is may uh, uh, Allah continue increasing in one, Amen. and uh, Amen. may Almighty Allah protect your life and Amen. the life of every loved one of the program. Amen. 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 Uh, I want to add one thing to this thing. Even uh, look at the 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 argument of uh, some of our scholars. Although we have passed those levels, but I just want to remind them of this mind program that okay. they used to say that uh, you do not a jammy or big one that doesn't know how to recite Arabic and doesn't know how to the Quran. That, that's, and that's they, and they have seen all these things and they cannot even come out to the book all those things. Because they are, not, they are not concerned. They are less concerned. They are not concerned. Yeah. And look at look at what you found with this program you, you did uh, this mind now. I'm sure that it will, it will, it will correct many errors. And it will, it, will, it will lead many people that um, maybe they, they were already about to to, yeah, yeah, yeah. They, to, to bring them back to the to to to, to, the, to the right path. Yeah, yeah. And, 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 as I said earlier, my prayer for you is may all metal continue to be with you. Amen. You. Amen. All Amen. the effort or the plan of the enemy against you shall not prosper. Amen. Amen. And Amen. you will overcome every challenges that come your way. Amen. And come uh, Amen. Uh, Amen. Uh, on the will of Amen. Islam. Amen. Amen. And may all mercy Allah continue to, to, to increase uh, 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 the Islam. To, 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 to make Islam uh, victory, I mean, victory, victory over all the uh, uh, plans of enemies to Jesus. Uh, Amen. Salaamu alaykum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. I have more, just a few minutes to call it a day because um, I have another program tomorrow as usual. 
Ni fat. Well, alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. If I, I intend traveling to Abe Guta this afternoon, if I, you know the worst part of it? I left my house for that land in Abe Okuta so that to see the progress on the corner piece that I've paid for. I left my house 8 o'clock in the morning. Could you believe? I was at Ibafo around 2, two o'clock. I just have to turn back because the old drop is too hectic. The old drop was just too much. If I when my car got overheated, I just have to, please driver, let's go back to Lagos. I didn't be, I tried going to Abeokuta as it was this afternoon. If I, this program will not be out tonight. Because I know I know I will still be on the road coming back from Abeokuta. So I, I employ our our government to do something to that road. That uh, express road is too tedious. The old drop is too tedious. I spent two hours between Bagada and uh, in Bagada alone. I spent two hours, two hours in Bagada alone. That got just no, there, no, no. That's not. There, you know, there's no repair on the road. We don't even know what happened. We don't know what caused the the uh, the old drop. But when, it, when we go to Alakpere, the old drop continues. When we go to Togate, it lessens a lot, a, a little. Then going to the front again with, from that junction, in fact, it's too much. Please, government, do something. In that road, we belongs to the federal government anyway. It belongs to the federal government. From Papa Paya down to, down to Ibadan. Federal government road. Please. I'm planning the Minister of Works, Mr. Rajiv Ashola, please come to our aid in Lagos and in Ogo State. It's too tedious. That road, in fact, I don't know. And that of a, uh, that of a, uh, Abe Okuta, Lagos Abe Okuta Express Road. From anything from Abulia Igba, downward, it's too bad. Just too bad. Please. Come to our aid in Lagos. We are for, we are once a Lagos state governor, and you are not the minister of works. Please come and repair Lagos for us. May Allah be with you. Now, I expected Christians to call in anyway, but they didn't. They cannot defend it, so they have to keep quiet. They cannot defend anything. I know they've learned their lesson anyway. Please, do not be that idiot. It's a bunch. It's a liar. It's a, de it's a deceiver. It's an agent of the devil. From the chosen church. In Bagada. I'm sorry. In Nijesha. So, may Allah be with us. The present viewers and the later viewers. May you be blessed. Is now uh, not the best. Hello, 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 yeah, good evening. Hello, hello, good evening, sir. Yeah. Evening, sir. Fine, who is calling from where? Yes, sir. Oh, it's uh, not sir. Okay, that's a lot from UK. Good evening, not sir. Well, uh, yeah, you see, when you spoke about Photoshop, and I remembered that, oh, I've got a Photoshop, um, Photoshop in the uh, app. Okay. And even while I'm not a professional at doing it, I sent, I sent something to your WhatsApp. Okay. Look at it, even when I'm not a professional, just see. So I believe you totally that it was a photoshopped picture. Yeah. So everything was photoshopped. Of course. His story was photoshopped. Of course. His picture was photoshopped. photoshopped. <laughs> but you see, the truth is that 
the story was not meant for you and I. It wasn't meant for you and I. It was actually meant for the, I mean, for the, for the nominal ones. You understand? For all those Muslims who are one leg in, one leg out. Those are the people it was meant for. It wasn't meant for you and I. It was meant for Muslims who will pray in the morning and go to church in the, I mean, on Sunday, things like that. So there is nothing, there is actually no, let whoever sits down to listen to him, you cannot listen to him for more than five, for more than five minutes one of you before you know this person is nothing but a liar. Yeah, exactly. I've, I've just seen, <laughs> seen that job there. No, that's my face which I have superimposed on can, can you imagine? You, can see you, are, that. you are just like the former imam. <laughs> uh, yeah, no, I didn't. Yeah, you know, and I've just done that, not even not even being a professional. Can you imagine? Give it to a professional to do, they will do <laughs> they a better, they will course, do a better, better job. Such as, <laughs> yeah, you now think, yeah, it's just, it's just a face, it's just a face swap. La ilaha illallah. Just a face yes, swap, no, of course, of course. a face swap uh, photoshopping. Yeah, yeah, so it's yeah. Just, they're just, they're just liars. Allah, Allah, they build, Allah. they build their religion on lies. Of course, of course. And then you can, you see, you don't even blame those who are, uh, you don't blame the pastors because they are looking for money. You blame the gullible ones. You see, even with all these scandals that are coming out, I mean, day in, day out. Yeah. You see, Father, that even with all those scandals, some in UK here, their pastor was caught, sent to prison <laughs> for defiling young and minors, yes. for raping Online. men, you know? And yet, do you still have people in that church? Yeah, yeah. You see people whose pastors were, were were arrested for stealing, whose pastors were arrested for all those gory offenses. Yeah. Yet they're still gone. So they're just gullible. They're not yeah. they're not they're, there's nothing you can do about them. Yeah. But for the Muslim, we just have to we just I mean, you can't do more than what you are doing. Yeah. yeah look all these things you are hearing, they are lies. They are not verifiable. You went there Nobody, nobody could. I mean, how could if you are even going to talk of being posted uh, to a state, you yeah. can't even choose. You can't choose on your state. Uh, not, so you are, you are going to choose on your from, state. From not Ibadan. Your... <laughs> not Ibadan. <laughs> the number of the number of our fans, real or legible ones. <laughs> In in uh, in your state in the battle, uh, who are still looking for uh, jobs? Uh, I mean, you can't you <laughs> can't count the them. And uh, now post they are uh, now post somebody from uh, Medo from State. Kogi? These no. are these are just yeah, or Kogi, yeah, from Kogi State. Can you imagine that? These are just nothing but lies. Without and no, no other way to look at it other than the lies. But they know who they plan to outwink. Of you course, know, they want to course. outwink yeah, yeah, just so the really nominal, the nominal really ones. No, there's there's really nothing to it. They, they, I mean, their lies are you can easily puncture them. Uh, oh, they all, I mean, they they couldn't. I mean, they they had the voice. They couldn't hear the voice. Mm -hmm. You can see the similarity with okay. Paul, exactly. with Paul's life. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. can see it. It's just, yeah. I mean, it's just, it's just liars. Pretty. Honestly, what I wonder why, why, why you still have, why you still have even a single person in Christianity there. But I understand. Allah says, if he had wished, everybody would of have course, known the way. It is just by yeah. design. Yeah. That is Allah's design. Yeah. Some yeah. people will never, Feel. never, they will never yeah. know what the truth yeah. is. Assalamu As alaikum. Now, look at what does Anasi do to, to the program. He photoshopped himself. I have compared the picture. Uh, the so-called Hazan Yakubu. You can imagine. It's mere Photoshop. <laughs> he just put himself in that picture <laughs> and removed the original man 
from that place and put himself. That's just it. Say Photoshop. And it was printed out and showed to the congregation. And I look at ah, because people are so gullible. I don't know. What lie is good to be a Muslim, alhamdulillah. No one will ever tell me that. I will confirm. I will go to that mosque or that church to confirm. <laughs> Hello? I told, you, I told you one time, the guy that called himself Mohammed Aminu, the same story, he saw the light. What's the to lie? Who's on the line from uh, there? Ustaz, I just, I just called back. I just, I just decided to call back again. Okay. You remember the story? You remember the story you followed up up to about that lady that was using that five about five churches use her hand exactly. to perform miracles. Exactly. The same. <laughs> did you see? Did you? Yeah, I remember. I remember. Did you see called you to say that look? Did you see any Christian call you on it? For we are nobody. Nobody called, nobody. Even not even that night. Are people not are people not still in that church when their pastor was exposed? Of course they are there. They are still there. They are still there. And now I they are still know. they can they can never they can ah, never lie, 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 except lie. except if God uh, except if God arrested them. They've already been brainwashed. Of course, of course, of course. And they will come out to tell us that they know more they know better than than, than the Muslim. Now, they are already brainwashed. No, they don't until, have anything but yes. Until we have an organization it's just that will be arresting them some, for some, that. Some, some, it's just unfortunate that some, some Muslims, you know, kind of foiling for them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They will, they will, they will. Look at look at that look at that story that you followed up up to Oshogo yeah. and you exposed that 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 that, that, that woman. And now. We the video it. of of the five of, of the five pastors that use that same woman mm -hmm. as a miracle are still on it. Went viral, uh -huh. but people are still in that church today. Still, of course, they are still there. They never question their pastor. They never. They never. That's they, they will never question their they pastors. Never, they never, they never. So that's why you will know that they are they are they are senseless. Of course, they don't have of course. It. No, they are they might, they might, they might, they might be professor in the in English professor in whatever uh, 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 profession they choose to be. Uh, but they are, they are gullible. They of are, they are free. Once get to religion, they are gullible. They are not, they are not sharp. No. They are not perfect at all, and they cannot even reason <laughs> for just one second. None of them call you since that day. None, none of them call you to do what you say. None, none. <laughs> None. He sang that has that is always following you up and down where he you are programmed. He, he didn't call me. He never, he he never say anything about he it. He didn't never he, 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 he had no comment on it. He, 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 he never said anything about it. Of course. I don't know. You can see how gullible they are. Lie, lie, lie. I don't know. Is he sang blind? Can't he, why didn't he call those pastors and, and tell them what, what they were doing is wrong? They will not listen to him. Who is he? Who is that? He has no church. <laughs> People, they, they will think he wanted to have his own congregation. And he has been trying uh -huh. for the past 10, 15 years. He has never owned a church. The guy they try, oh, but God, no, allow him. <laughs> he, will be, he, will be chasing, he, and he will be chasing you up and down. <laughs> now, He'll be chasing you where you have I'm program up and I'm down. I'm his problem. <laughs> <laughs> I'm his problem. <laughs> and I'll remain his problem till he die. <laughs> 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 Unless Allah raises his ass. That guy, I don't know. Well, I don't think like he's not going to hurt him. <laughs> Yes, Inshallah, till Tuesday, when we meet again with our, our Sheikh Al Mubarak, a Jai from Ekpe, in Yoruba program. Wednesday, I wonder English, Inshallah. We have a lot of it to be, to treat. Inshallah. Till we meet again, may Allah be with every one of us, those that are here now, and those that will join us later. Subhanahu wa rabika, Rabbil Inzat, Amen, Sifun, Wassalamu alayhi wa sallim, Alam Rabbil Amin, Salah al Karim.
Assalamu alaikum. Ijo risala to la Ak Society International. No fias ko yi kesi gbogbo muslimi ododo oloju anu olore lati da si ise da wa yi risala to la Ak Dawa Project. E ti won gbe kale lati ko ile eko igbalode ti esin Islam ati ti eko Western Education. Koda boarding tu wa nbe ati de eleyi ti o gbe esin Islam laruge bakana risala to la Ak Dawa Project yi yo tun ni ile wosan ti won yo ti ma toju awon eniyan bi Olorun ti se to ati sunna Lord Muhammad to ba wa ribe ajwal ikhwan fi Allah eyan mo ya mi ninu esin ise daware o ise Olorun re eje ajumo se 200 million naira project ni for his start lati fi bere na ile to ma ja ti igbalode ti o si je gbadugbaja eje agbaruku ti Risalatul Aqdawa Society International lati ba ko hospital ati ile eko igbalode esin Islam ati ti Western Education na Wema Bank PLC te ma son wo si re o 0223864937 Rizalatul Akidawa Society International ni oruko to wa nbe we ma bank ni o kolon ba la ko gba ni ibada fun wa fun alaye lekun rere e pin 0802 Ma'as salam